How's it going, you guys? My name is Dom Rager, and welcome to a conspiracy theory <clears throat> about some Bethesda games, alright? And feel free to leave your guys' opinions, make videos about it. If you guys make videos, make sure to link them down below or react to them and all that, alright? So, basically what this video is going to be is about is that, like, I thought this a while back, right? But there's mostly, everybody's probably thought of this, is Skyrim... Dishonored and Fallout in basically in the same time period. Like saying, okay, Skyrim is Renaissance, Dragon, Dragonborns, Urban Legends, like, or not myths, I mean myths like fucking dragons and stuff like that. Is this, could this be the start, like any Skyrim, starting with the first Skyrim, could that be the start off all of that and then move up through the Skyrim and then this Skyrim be the renaissance or something like that it could be it's poorly explained by me obviously but there are conspiracies that these games in some way are connected all right like my my personal th uh, theory is that Skyrim is supposed to be the renaissance era you know dragons medieval shit like that knights stuff like that Either it's either this Skyrim or Morrowind. One of those would count as that, all right? Or not Morrowind, Oblivion. One of those would count up under that. This would probably be around. What could it be? Could possibly be Roman times and all that, because there is a bunch of war happening when you first start off in the game and all that. So yeah. Although I'm going to be streaming Skyrim right after this video goes up. So yeah. Alright, so, with that being said, could there be a possible connection between all of this? There could be, but there also could not, there couldn't be. There are references to a bunch of stuff, they reference each other in and out, like, uh, like, uh, Fallout 3, it referenced this, it referenced, the uh, Skyrim, but we're not going off references, we're going off either the time period and all that, and then how it's progressing each time we play a game that's made by Bethesda. Like that's open world like Skyrim. And then next is Dishonored. And then next is Fallout. And then from Fallout. Well, who knows. Alright. To be honest, who knows. I think Fallout is the final frontier to be honest. But yeah. Dishonored. What could Dishonored fall under? Well, I was thinking about it. It could be either from the Bonic Plague era. Or the industrial age, because it feels like, or the industrial revolution, I mean. Because there's a bunch of stuff that refers to that. But the take on it is supposed to be a steampunk Victorian era, I believe. So this is going to be either Victorian era and all that, or it's in a mix of between Victorian era and then industrial, you know. Because there hasn't been that many advances in the game yet. To call it like you know mechanical wise, so I'd count this as the Victorian area. All right, the second one would be most likely Industrial Revolution, and I don't have gameplay of the second one because I don't know where the fuck my Dishonored disc is. So I apologize for that, you guys. But yeah, that's what I think my my thing is. All right, I think Skyrim is Renaissance slash, or it's either Roman Empire time or Renaissance. One of those. Poorly explained, I'm sorry. You can obviously, you know, create your own theory about this. However you want, leave a link to it. I'll react to it. Alright. Second. In this, in this, it's because I feel like it's a mix between either uh, Victorian age because of every the Victorian era thing stuff, my bad. Um, because there aren't that many advances in technology in this game and i know it's supposed to take in, it's supposed to be old school and all that but still there's no technological advances in this but yet again i feel like it's either fucking um <clears throat> the industrial because there is the bubonic plague and all that and remember after the bubonic plague the renaissance the renaissance the fucking revolution uh fuck <laughs> sorry the industrial revolution went up like, you know, that was one of the things right after. So I feel like this is in between that, like, progressing from that to to right now the Industrial Age. This is what I feel like. Bubonic Plague, Industrial Age. That's what I think. I fucked up towards the end. I'm sorry, you guys. Um, next. Fallout. You know how I mentioned that earlier and all that? Okay. Theory is, right? 
that all of this is building up to the final frontier, which is Fallout. Why do I call it the final frontier? It is because at the end, it's basically the fucking atomic scare, atomic bomb scare did not work. So that transpired all the way into like 2050, I believe, if I'm correct, around there. And then one of the countries from Europe or China or one of those decided to nuke the U.S. And it took like around five seconds and that was the Great War. All right, and this is basically the United States had no allies because they were draining resources and everything from almost every place. So basically, it goes Renaissance, Victorian, and then this. All right, because I think Dishonored 2 is supposed to be Industrial Age. So it's going to be in Renaissance or uh, Renaissance, uh, fuck, Victorian and Industrial. This is going to be the final frontier because this is where it all comes to an end. Alright? Because they get nuked, done. And I know it's not every place, but mostly the United States is just done. Alright, so this is why I think they're connected is because... It's because they kind of go together, all of them, alright? They basically go all together. It goes from the beginning... You know, myths and shit like dragons and all that to steampunk from that to to uh, like industrial and then now this. The reason I think that they're dressed like that and the homes are like that is because of the nuclear reactor. They didn't they focus more on that than they did with the microchip and everything. So that's why they have pit boys and all that shit. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Make your own videos if you guys feel like it. Um. And just link them down in the description and I shall react to them. But make sure it's about this topic, not, not, some, uh, not some other shit. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. And as always, stay awesome. I'll be live streaming later right now, uh, probably later after this video goes up a couple minutes or a couple hours after it goes up. So yeah, talk to you guys later. And if you guys enjoyed this video, like it, subscribe, I guess. I think we're at 126 right now, 25 around there. Thank you guys for all the support on these videos. And the Mafia 3 video is actually about to reach 3,000 3, views, which is actually pretty fucking amazing. Alright, so enough of me fucking talking. Talk to you guys.